Very happy to be joined by Sanford Police Chief Cecil Smith. Uh, Chief, I, I, you and I have seen this video of this, this mother yanking her kid off when she recognizes he's one of the protesters. That's got to make your job as law enforcement a lot easier when the parents are involved, and probably that makes it that much more difficult when the parents are not involved and just let their kids run wild. Absolutely. You know what? One of the biggest things we always talk about is parental responsibility and making sure that the, uh, the parents are actively involved in their lives on a daily basis. And when you first got down here, just after the, during the Trayvon Martin thing, you and I talked about this, you said the first thing you were going to do is be very proactive and go out into the community. Do you credit that with why nothing happened after the Trayvon Martin, uh, the George Zimmerman verdict came down, why we didn't see this uh, riots or, or any unrest in the Sanford community? Well, you know what, first, I, I believe that, you know, one of the major things was the fact that the uh, community was very involved in what was taking place. And first off, the community wanted to ensure that uh, things were safe. They were at the table. They're in the discussions. They were decision makers in making sure that Sanford remains safe and remains safe as of today. Well, there were people involved up in Baltimore, too. I mean, the, the, the family of, uh, of Mr. Gray, they, they asked for, for peace. They did not want this. And yet on the day of the funeral is when the riots, riots began. Why are things exploding there and they did not hear? You know what? Uh, it's kind of hard to determine what took place up there. But I will tell you that here in Sanford, you know, the, the parents, the, uh, the people, the elders, our churches, our administration, and the police department sat down and discussed. You know, we have discussions and not destruction. That is one of the major reasons why I think that we were very successful here, remain successful, is that we've had an opportunity to sit down and air out what our views are, look at what the concerns were, to resolve the issues that have uh, affected us here in Sanford. Chief, real quick, um, there's sort of been a coalition of gangs, or at least that's the, that's the story, up there in Baltimore. Do you ever worry that that kind of violence up there might bleed down here to Sanford? Well, we would hope that it's just rumor. Uh, again, uh, working in the communi community and having those communications, we have uh, nothing on our radar right now to show that there's been any threats against any of our local law enforcement officers here in Sanford. Well, Chief Smith, it's always a pleasure to talk to you, and uh, we, we appreciate you spending some time with us this afternoon. Thank you. Yep, no problem.